Hey guys, today I am talking about this new piece I did for this new series that I'm working on. I'm going to go over a little bit of um, the background of the series and then a little bit of the technical aspects I did for this specific painting. So this is the first painting of a series that I'm calling Women in Nature. You know, <laughs> nothing like super special about that title. It's more of a series of approaching women and their connection with nature and with God and this humbling beauty and willingness to be the best that they can be. I've chosen a, a few women that I am including in this series um, and a lot of it just has to do so much with the fact that, that these women have really embraced their role as mothers, as women, as you know, all these different things. Um, and that innate connection that they have found within themselves that is similar to the innate connection that many people find with nature. And so it's kind of this combination. This specific painting is done by of a friend. Her name is Stevie Marie, and you can go see her stuff on Instagram. She has some wonderful stuff on Instagram. But um, she has has been so nice to let me just <laughs> take whatever pictures I want of her to paint. I love how this painting turned out. It really was a fun one to paint, and I'm looking forward to being able to paint more of these. Um, this one I name, I titled The Art of Work. I think sometimes we think of the word art as a way to find beauty in things. And so this painting specifically kind of is approaching this series with that there is beauty in the work that we do as women. And Stevie lives on a farm, and she has a bunch of animals she takes care of. And so this specific one, she's holding one of her chickens, and it's kind of this whole encompassing, you know, kind of pioneer woman who is willing to work and create the best for her family. And I really wanted to emphasize that, and that the fact that being able to work hard and do things for your family is not incompatible with being beautiful and being feminine. And she really encapsulates that idea for me. And so the, this part right here, I'm starting to paint this chicken and I saved it for last because honestly it was like the most fun thing to paint. You know, it, it kind of brought up some challenges. You know, how do you paint a chicken without painting every feather, especially if all the feathers are variegated? But this one, I ended up doing kind of a base color of the white so I could form some of the shapes first. And then I put in the black feathers. This is similar to the one, the Harry Potter mural that I did where the black feathers helped to create some of those forms. And then I went back over it and did the highlights of the white feathers on top of that. And so that's the end of my video. Um, this one was a pretty short one. I actually missed some of the video. Um, I forgot to video some of the middle part where I was painting her dress. And so if you like this video, just go like, comment, subscribe, um, and you're also welcome to go to my website and sign up for my email list and you can get um, emails on when I post my paintings for sale. Thank you so much for watching.